Hello friends, welcome to LMS Research Support. In this video, we are going to see how to draw a simple circuit diagram in Microsoft Visio. So let us see how we can draw a simple circuit diagram in Microsoft Visio. Today we are going to take a boost converter. So this is a boost converter. It comprises of a battery, an inductor, a switch. Here a MOSFET will be given and a diode, a capacitor and a load. So this is the diagram we are going to resemble in our Microsoft Visio with the good quality. So let us go for today's video. Open your Microsoft Visio. So just you have to go on your search shapes and then search for your shapes. That is search for your components. First we are going to search a battery. So you will get a battery. Just a drag and drop. Next we are going to type inductor we will get an inductor next one is your capacitor next one is switch in that uh, circuit diagram I have shown that a MOSFET is a switch that is used we can use IGBT as a switch also so just type IGBT so you will get IGBT next one is load we will type a resistor whether you take it as a uh, resist this block also that is resistive block also or you can take just a resistance also ok then assemble your components as in your circuit diagram so you just assemble in the order there is battery inductor switch a diode and a resistor so we have we just type diode just drag and drop your diode then assemble your components accordingly once you assemble this component like this means you will be able to draw your uh, lines very easily so first you have to fix your size and uh, you can arrange in this order so in that uh, picture you can see in the circuit diagram you can see uh, a diode is connected in parallel with your switch so in order to connect uh, a diode in parallel with switch you can just copy the diode and paste here to rotate your component just you control R to rotate and then you can connect your diode so after connecting your diode you can select both the components and you can go for grouping so group, if you make grouping means then you can able to adjust the switch uh, with the diode that is you can make it as a single component so let us see how it can be made now here connected your diode uh, parallel to your switch so in that uh, diagram we can sorry in that uh, connection you can see there is a extension in your lines we cannot uh, connect it accurately so in order to make it accurate you can use uh, your trim option so in order to use your trim option you have to select the lines which is needed to be trimmed you have to select this line and control this line so after that this line select just uh, in search type trim and then click enter and then select this line you want to trim then click delete so automatically it will be trimmed so that way you can get an accurate result of your connection next one is you have to trim this part so for that you have to again select this one again select this one go for trim and then you can click delete so there so thereby you can get an uh, accurate shape of the switch uh, the output of the switch will be very good next we see how grouping is made so this is how you have connected next in order to make grouping you have to select the whole thing so the diode which is connected in parallel with the switch and the switch so select and just in grouping type group group objects group so if you make this group as mean if, if you click this group means you can make the shape as a single shape you can adjust the shape with the diode 
so you can adjust accordingly how, how much the size of the switch you can want so this is how grouping and trimming is made in Microsoft Visio so this is the circuit diagram after connection so you can connect the uh, all the wires and then uh, make the circuit unique that is you have to select weight and you get to come given two so whatever the thickness of the circuit what is the input of the circuit you want you can select and give so I can select 2.4 whatever you want you can give so this is how you can make simple circuit diagrams and using Microsoft Visio and also you can use grouping trimming for the accurate results of the circuit diagram so by drawing that accurately you can use this in your research articles so because uh, the di diagrammatic the pict pictorial representation of the uh, <coughs> uh, circuits are very very important especially during modes of operation you have to represent it very neatly you can uh, give the operation also when inductor is charging you can add arrow marks etc in this uh, lines you can get everyone everything so by this you can make an accurate circuit diagram using Microsoft Visio hope this video will brings a brings a idea about how to make grouping and trimming in your Microsoft Visio thank you for watching our videos have a nice day